Where to? Wherever Templar affairs lead us. Leo, it's not like you to set out without a plan. Plan or no plan, we choose our own battlefield. And hey, we're not most at ease when we're at sea. Right you are. Let's set sail. Shane. Let's hope it brings us closer to the artifacts. So Achilles tasked you with this mission? No. He tasked me to task you. We need to find what was stolen from Mac and Dal Shay. You have to recover the precursor box of manuscript. This is your mission. And what's yours? To watch your arse. Achilles doesn't really trust me, does he? Give it time, Shay. Do this for him. For us. He'll do much more than earn his trust. Liam, do you know what Achilles writes about? I see him in his office all the time, bent over his papers. He keeps records and accounts, studies what little is known about the pieces of evil. And of course, he corresponds with assassins on other continents. Of course. Liam, you can be a right horse's arse when it comes to assuming everyone knows the same as you. I cannot help if Achilles wants me to be familiar with our counterparts in Europe and elsewhere. Said like his favorite son. Connor's his favorite and only son. Then Achilles is heir. Connor may inherit the house, but you'll be mentor. We'll see. Whatever you say, Prince Regent of the Assassins. If you call me that again, I'll throw you in the ocean. Towards our island home, a mainmast sprung, a whaling done, and we ain't got far to roam. Our stones so bones are carried away. What care we for that sound? A living tale is after us. Thank God we're homeward bound. Rolling down to Maui, me boys. Off the wind. Two up tops. Douse the mains. Give me some speed. Clue up. Clue up. Draw a banker. Trust me, you will sell those lobster by the tongue in France. Ah, the cabbage farmer has returned. About time. We have a lead on that curious manuscript. I'd be surprised if you can read it. No one can read it, imbecile. This is why the Templar are taking so long with it. But one of our allies has caught a glimpse of their work. A pirate? A spy who worked with the pirate. We set sail for Anticosti. That should prove a good test for this floating cesspit you call a ship.
How trustworthy are the pirates? I consider them brothers, Shay. When the time comes, they will end aid and help us fight the Templars. If only there was beef would realize the Templars were pulling their strings. Are the Templars truly in control in the colonies? Not quite, but their influence reaches far and wide. And what about the spy we're meeting? You need not worry about Le Chasseur. He is loyal to the Brotherhood. As it happens, he also has friends in both the French and English fleets. And he knows more about what goes on in these parts than you can ever hope to learn. So, Liam, what could you tell me about Adewale? You obviously admire the man. I had the honor of working with him once. I've never known anyone who'd done so much for our cause. So much more than that. Adewale was already a legend before joining the Brotherhood. He was a pirate, the scourge of the West Indies, rubbing elbows with the likes of Blackbeard, Woods Rogers, and Calico Jack Rackham. Calico who? Oh, read a book, will you? About 20 years ago, Adewale intercepted a Templar convoy and stole a mysterious package. He traveled to Porto France and entrusted it to a woman he believed was loyal to our cause. Let me guess. She wasn't. She'll be nearby, Captain. An English vessel, and she looks to be in trouble. That's fine indeed. Perhaps we should aid her journey to the bottom of the sea. Now let's not be too hasty. She's full of crown cargo. Take a look through your spyglass and see for yourself. Pretty sight. I say this is a good day to lighten King George's pockets. Be careful. A few shots should be enough to cripple her. Too much damage and she'll go down with all souls and all spoils. Or and loot her before the crew knows what he left.
Brace yourselves! Now, the sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. We should strengthen the Morgan before going any further. There's a harbour master station nearby. We'd spend our new wealth on improvements. I didn't realize there was a brotherhood in Haiti. Yes. Francois McCandle is their mentor. He gathers many of his assassins from the Maroons. Those are escaped slaves and their children, right? They are. A shame, though. He escaped terrible conditions only to be killed in that earthquake. But... Haiti's a French colony now. Aye, oh, it is. And here, the assassins are helping King Louis. But in Haiti, the French own the slaves who are set free by the assassins. Our struggle is beyond political borders, Shay. Anticosti shouldn't be far. Keep us on course, Captain. There's Perse, Shay. Small fishing village. Is this the place? I see nothing but fishermen and their gear. Right. Perse and fishing go hand in hand. It will serve our purposes well enough. French fish these waters first, but King George is laying claim to more every year. The locals are caught in the middle. Trim us off the wind! Anchor! You'd better borrow some coin. Bartering with an empty purse won't get you very far.
What do you be needing today, then? My thanks for your trust, Captain. qu'il se dépêche de valider ma mutation à saint domingue Pourquoi diantre veux-tu aller là-bas Mon cousin, il possède une profession. Seigneur, mais qu'est-ce qu'il fait We should resume course to Anticosti, Captain. Indeed. The chasseur is waiting for us. The sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. The Morrigan seems sturdy enough for the challenge. Raise those sheets! Let's move! Spread our wings to the wind! Ships, ahoy! More fishermen from Perse. Floating cargo! Catch. 
ship. These waters are full of enemy, enemy ships. They're sinking the fishing boats. You must believe those fishermen strayed into their waters. These cowards must pay. And would you look at that? Standing right in our way to Anticosti. What say you? We sink every last one of them. For once, I find myself agreeing with you, Shay. Stranger things have happened. They'll sail. Put out all she'll take. Resume course to Anticosti, Captain. Indeed. The chasseur is waiting for us. The sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. The Morrigan seems sturdy enough for the challenge. Ships ahoy! More fishermen from Perse. The foe patrols these waters closely, Captain. Enemy ships! They're sinking the fishing boats! You must believe those fishermen strayed into their waters. These cowards must pay! And would you look at that? Standing right in our way to Anticosti. What say you? They sink every last one of them. For once, I find myself agreeing with you, Shay. Stranger things have happened. Let's go on. Not too far from Anticosti Island now. 
Will your friend the spy be waiting for us? Yes. I hope the chasseur has more information about the manuscript. Maybe you'll have the whole thing figured out for us. And maybe I'm Emperor of Rome. Obvious Caesar. Salt air, open skies. Man out on the ocean. It's as free as a man can be. What do you say, Liam? We're out here for a reason, Shay. Mind your duty. Well, what's the point of freedom if you cannot breathe deep and enjoy it? The Templars stick to this continent like tar. Don't feel liberated until we pry them off. Seems to me we should just talk to them like men instead of skulking around. And would you smile and wish them a good day as they lay their boot on your neck? Of course not. They're going to bastards who want to control the world and everyone in it. Never forget. We have nothing in common with that, of course. There it is. Anticosti. The chasseur should be there. And with any luck, he will know where to find that manuscript. As much sail as you can! All sail! Act like it. A... 
Trim the yards off the wind. That wind's trouble, Captain Cormac. He's off the wind. Stop the ship here, Captain. We've arrived at Anticosti Island. Fur trade. <laughs> Not well enough to put beef on my family's plates. If you want beef, raid more British bricks. They're loaded down with barrels. Oh, yes. Their Irish farms yield much meat, don't they? But that is smart management. Far better than the locals could do. Take a look at this. I borrowed these plans from a Royal Navy ship of the line. They are like nothing I have ever seen. Good. We could use some more powerful weapons. Le Chasseur, allow me to present our associate, Sheikh Cormac. Gentlemen, I have news. On this same ship, I spied the manuscript you seek. It was written in an exotic language I did not recognize and was full of drawings, plants, and animals out of an opium dream. But were there no charts, no, no, no maps? No. There may have been some kind of code, but neither I nor the roast beefs could ken Where is the manuscript now? The man who brought it said a man named Washington sent him. I know that name. He's an important Templar, isn't he? He is. Lawrence Washington has great ambitions that Templars have helped fulfill. Shay. Let's return and find him. You, sir, have our thanks. 